Hi everyone. Here's a quick video showing you how to open an assignment from your teacher, respond to it, and turn it back in. So I can come to my main page as I've logged in as a student, and I can see a couple of new assignments that my teacher has asked me to complete. And I can click on the assignment here if I'd like, or I can go to classwork and see them there. So I'm going to do this one for addition because I haven't done that one yet. So I click on addition, and it says please open the attached document and respond. So I need to open up this document, and I read what my teacher has asked me to do. Please answer the following. What is 2 plus 2? 2 plus 2 equals 4. There are no other questions, so I'm done. All I have to do is click Turn In. It asks me, do I want to turn in my work? It tells me an attachment is going to be submitted. Yes, I do. I click Turn In. And I have the option over here where I can type a comment into my teacher. If for some reason you need to explain something or you need to ask your teacher a question, here's a place where you can do that. If I decide that I don't want to submit that, I made a mistake, I can click unsubmit and it'll pull it back and I can resubmit it. And that's it. I'm done. So let's take a look at that other assignment I had here, Journal Entry Science Lab. This is one where my teacher has actually asked me to create a document from scratch. I don't have a document to click on. She's told me to think about what we did in science today and create my own Google Doc where I need to write a paragraph explaining what evidence supports the conclusions that we came up with in class. So I'm going to click on View Assignment. And again, there's no document for me to click. I have to create my own. I can type class comments that will go to the entire class. I can also type private comments that will go only to my teacher. So now I need to create my own document. I click over here on Add or Create and I can choose what type of document I'm going to create. My teacher told me to use Google Docs, so that's what I'm going to click on. I could also upload a file from my Google Drive. I could link a file from the internet, or I could upload a file from my computer. I would only do this if the teachers told me to do that, but she didn't. She told me to create a Google Doc, so that's what I'm going to do. I click on Docs, and it already has a title. It gets it from the class. I don't want to change that. So I'm just going to click in the document and type my response. So I've typed in my entry. In Science Today, we decided what we saw was a chemical change. We know this because we saw bubbles, smelled an odor, and a gas was created. Now, I would probably need to write a little more than this since she asked me for a paragraph, but I'm not going to make you wait for that. All I have to do is click Turn In. Again, it confirms. Do you want to turn in your work? Yes, I do. And I had the same options as before, and that's all I have to do. Now, let's see what it looks like after my teacher grades it. So my teacher has told me that she's graded my assignment, and I can see here that she's posted a new assignment, and I'm going to click on Classwork. I come in here to my Journal Entry Science Lab, and I see that it's been graded, and I can view assignment. And right up here, I can see that I got a 95 out of a 100, and I can see that there's a comment here. Great work. I like how you gave three characteristics of a chemical change. And if your teacher makes actual comments in your document itself, you may have to open up the document and see what your teacher wrote. And I can see my teacher wrote, maybe you could write a few more sentences. So that's pretty much it. This is where you can see what your grade was and what comments your teacher might have given you, some feedback your teacher might have given you. Hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching.